I get giddy thinking about starting the tour in Hawaii because, you know, I just think that beginning points of seasons are magical. Um, not that the end is not, but beginning points are magical. You know, every surfer is there for the same thing. I want to win the world title. You know, and, and in some cases with our women in Honolulu or our men at Pipe, you know, sometimes you're entering that, that contest with only four or five people in contention. I think number one, by, by, by moving it to the beginning, it allows us a couple of things. It allows us to really deepen our partnerships with, you know, with, with your community, with North Shore community, um, all the partnerships that we have with the state. We now can actually like ramp into a year and celebrate the heritage of Hawaii and the importance of surfing to the culture in a way that you can't necessarily do going into the, the world championships. Um, surfers have a different mindset. They're, they're, they're much more excited and open and optimistic versus the end of the year. We've got triple crown at play. Um, you've got requalification at play and you've got the world championships at play. And so sometimes, you know, everybody's just like really locked in provides great drama for the fans, but boy, just, I mean, we could sit here for the next seven podcasts and talk about all the great things we want to do to kick off the season and, you know, Honolulu or our pipeline. So, uh, I'm excited by that a lot. Uh, Maui, my second home. Uh, all my friends up in the upcountry in Kula want to say aloha. Uh, and uh, Jordan. And, and by the way, Grandma's Coffee's house uh, is, you know, I'd, I'd be staying up on Thompson Road and go down to Grandma's Coffee House and get my, get my coffee and, and uh, just go for my run up on that down Thompson Road. So, um, but anyways, just want to say thank you for having me. I'm super, super stoked to be here.